if you are wondering about the best method to present your project during your job interviews. In this lecture, I'll show you how to present the CICD pipelines with GitHub Actions project on AOS Note during your job interviews. This project is an excellent example to showcase during your interviews because it covers critical skills and experience required to be a cloud and DevOps engineer. Presenting this project during your interview will also demonstrate your proficiency in deploying dynamic applications in AWS using CI-CD pipeline and GitHub Actions, utilizing core AWS services such as VPC with public and private subnets, internet gateway, security groups, NAT gateways, application load balancer, ECS Firegate, ECR, Route 53, auto-scaling groups, and more. This project also demonstrates your ability to containerize applications using Docker and pushing your image to registries like Amazon ECR. Presenting this project during your job interview also shows your ability to build infrastructure in AWS using infrastructure as code tools like Terraform. It also shows your ability to migrate data for dynamic applications into RDS with tools like Flyway. And finally, this project also shows that you understand how to manage secrets with credentials management tools like AWS Secrets Manager and GitHub Actions Repository Secrets. Ultimately, this project will show your potential employer your expertise with cloud service providers like AWS and your familiarity with DevOps tools and processes such as CI-CD pipelines, GitHub Actions, Linux, Terraform, Docker, Git, GitHub, Bash Scripting, AWS CLI, Flyway, and Visual Studio Code. Once you have finished this project, your code will be stored in your GitHub repository and cloned to your computer. To present this project during your interview, open your local repository in Visual Studio Code and select the deploypipeline.yaml file. Once you have opened the file, change the value of the environment variable Terraform action to apply. Then save your changes and push the updates back to your GitHub repository. This will trigger your pipeline in GitHub Actions running the jobs to configure AWS credentials to allow GitHub Actions access to create resources within your AWS account. Deploying the infrastructure in AWS with Terraform and creating resources like VPC with public and private subnets, internet gateway, security groups, NAT gateways, application load balancer, auto-scaling groups, ECS Fargate, ECR, Route 53, and all the resources we need to deploy a dynamic application in AWS. The pipeline also initiates a self-hosted runner and create an Amazon ECR repository to store the application's Docker image. Once the ECR repository has been created, the pipeline also builds the Docker image for the application and push the image to the Amazon ECR repository. The pipeline will also export the environment variables for the Fargate containers into S3 and migrate the application's SQL script into the RDS database. Once these tasks are completed, the pipeline will terminate the self-hosted runner. Then it will create a new ECS tax definition revision. And in the final job, the pipeline will update the ECS service with the new tax definition, making the application accessible to the end users. After the pipeline has run, provide your domain name to your interviewers to access the site and be prepared to answer any questions about the project. Once you have finished your interview, open the deploypipeline.yaml file again and change the value of the environment variable Terraform action to destroy. Once you have changed the value, save the changes and push your updates back to the GitHub repository. This will trigger the pipelines again in GitHub Actions and run the job to clean up your infrastructure so that you don't get charged for the resources you have created. By following this process, you can confidently present this project in any interview. If you have any questions, 
don't hesitate to reach out. And best of luck with your job interviews. Bye.